Hello, boys and girls. My name is Ember, and I teach safety. Today, I would like you to meet my friend, Ash. Hello, everyone. Hello, Miss Ember. What are we going to talk about today? Today, we are going to talk about poisons. A poison is something that can make you sick, hurt, or kill you if it gets into your body. We should never play with, touch, or taste poisons. Where can I find poisons, Miss Amber? Poisons are found all around us. They are in our homes, at school, and even outside. Grown-ups use products to do things like clean the house, wash clothes, kill bugs and weeds, fix the car, and even make them well when they are sick. These products are safe as long as they are used the right way, but they can become poisons when they are used the wrong way. That is why you should always ask first before touching or tasting anything. How can poisons get into your body? Poisons can get into your body through your eyes if you get something sprayed into them. It can get on your skin if you spill a household product on yourself. If you smell or breathe in something from a container, it can enter your body through your nose. There are many things you see every day that can be a poison. Too much of anything can be bad for you. Miss Ember, can you teach me what kinds of poisons are around me so I can learn to be safe? Medicine is something given to us by a grown-up to make us feel better when we are sick or hurt. Medicine can be good for you, but it can also be a poison. Medicine is not candy, even though it may look like it. Pills and vitamins that your mom or dad might take or give you could look just like an M&M, a Skittle, a Starburst, Smarties, or gum, the candy that you might eat every day. How do I tell the difference? Follow these simple rules. One, only take medicine from a trusted adult. Two, tell an adult if you feel sick. Three, always ask an adult before you touch, smell, or taste anything. And four, only take the number of vitamins a grown-up gives you. Are there any other poisons my mom or dad would use that look like things I would eat or drink? That's a great question, Ash, and the answer is yes. Your mom might use cleaners like pine salt that could look like apple juice. Your dad could have things in the garage like windshield washer fluid that could look like the Gatorade drinks you might have in your refrigerator. This is why you should always ask first. Wow! It would be really dangerous to drink the wrong thing. I am always going to ask a grown-up before drinking anything I find. Ash, did you also know that some plants, flowers, and trees can make you sick or give you an itchy rash if you touch them or taste them? Plants are very pretty. They make our houses and yards look nice. Many plants that we see inside and outside are poisonous. We should never pick and eat any plant, berry, mushroom, or flower. Always ask first before touching flowers, plants, and berries. Ash, there is one last poison that is important for us to talk about. They are called aerosols. These are cans or bottles that can spray. Sprays are so strong that they can hurt your eyes if any spray gets into them. It is also dangerous to breathe the fumes from the spray. Some of these are spray paint, bug spray, bottles for cleaning, and hairspray. Beware of anything in a can or bottle. Always ask first. What do you do if you think someone has been poisoned? A poison center is the place to call when you think someone has swallowed or inhaled something that is not good for them. The poison center is always open every day of the year. You can call the poison control center at 
two, 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 one, two, two, two. If the person who took the poison cannot talk to you, then you need to call 911. Okay, how about if I give you a little test? I will show you pictures. If it is a poison, put thumbs down because it is bad. If it is safe, put thumbs up. Here's the first picture, a stuffed animal. So is this thumbs up or down? That's easy, thumbs up. Great, the next picture is a spray can. I remember, beware of anything in a can, so it's thumbs down. Excellent job, Ash. Next, here's a picture of a book. No problem, thumbs up. Wow, okay, this is a hard one. This is a picture of berries. That's not so hard, Miss Amber. I know you are not supposed to eat anything you find outside, so it's thumbs down. Do you know what this is a picture of, Ash? No, I'm not sure. If you don't know what it is, what should you do, Ash? Ask first. Great job. So what have you learned, Ash? Miss Amber, I have learned that poisons are all around me. In the kitchen, bathroom, in our garage, even outside in the backyard where I play. I should always ask an adult before I touch or taste anything. If I think someone has taken poison, I need to get an adult and call 1-800-222-1222. Ash, I am so proud of you. I think you have learned the most important rule about poisons. Always ask first. Remember that, boys and girls, always ask first. You could save your life or one of your friends' lives. Okay, Ash, let's say goodbye to the boys and girls. Bye, boys and girls. Goodbye, boys and girls. We will see you again soon.